It's kind of hard to hike with a mask, I'm not gonna lie. Oh sh guys, I am fan girly. We have the mother forkin' roomie here. So freaking dope. Chloe May, let's do it. Good morning, guys. What up? So today, <clears throat> wow, what's going on? This morning, Rem, actually, she's almost here. We are gonna record pretty basic. Before we do that, we're gonna go for a little hike, which I'm really excited for because we used to always go for hikes and then we kind of stopped, but I think she should be here any second. So yes, I'll give you a little outfit of the day. This is what we are wearing. My hat is from Nike, obviously. <laughs> My jacket's from Aloe. It's super thin. I like hiking with really thin jackets because I feel like in the beginning I'm cold and I think she's here. I'll do this later. Guys, we have made it to the top. It's kind of hard to hike with a mask, I'm not gonna lie. But if you're gonna hike with one, get your shop Alicia Marie. P.S. You've got this pay mask link below. Hi, Rome. Hi. I think this is the first time you've been on the vlog. Oh, during COVID? Yeah, because I, I put it on the main channel last time. Missed you guys. We missed you. But that's the update. Okay, bye. Guys, we just recorded. In the closet. In the closet. <laughs> Our food is here, I'm very excited. It is? Yeah. Yay! I know. I finally got ready. Like, finally. <laughs> I tried not to do too much heat to my hair today, so I only curled a couple pieces, not all of them. So I feel like it's like kind of weird today. But yeah, Pretty Basic was really good. Super excited for that. And I'm really not wearing that cute of an outfit. It's just whatever. Since I didn't finish my outfit of the day earlier, this is a top that Rem gave me. T-R-R-T. I'm trying to remember what brand this is. What does that say? Oh my God, I have no idea. <laughs> I think it's by the brand Rash, but I have no idea. But Rem gave it to me. It's just this really cute purple, like kind of crop top. Super cute. And then my sweatpants are from White Fox. I really like how these fit. They're just like, I don't know, they have like some cute detailing on them and stuff. We're not gonna get really like too ready today. I feel like I've been getting ready all week, like whatever. The point is, today's a chill day. Also, this is so weird. I'm home alone right now. It feels so freaking weird being here by myself just because with quarantine, like it's always been such a full house with like four people living here and Taryn and Ash have a few like random different errands to run today. So they're doing that. But I just thought it was really funny because I'm like, I don't, can't even remember the last time I was here by myself, especially for a vlog. I don't know. And it's weird today. I'm kind of in a cleaning mood, but the other part of me really needs to edit. I have like a few random things I need to do. I was like, you know what? We're going to get ready. We're going to do something. I don't know if it's going to be productive. I don't know if it's just going to be a chill, relaxed day. Maybe I'll end up swimming. I have no idea. The pool does look really Really nice. Maybe we'll go work on our tan later, but at the same time, I just got the new tanless self tanner, so that means I don't need to. So that's great. Oh shit. Okay. I do have a few random packages. I've been waiting to do it on camera. And the first one, guys, I am fan girly. If you know, you know. This video is actually sponsored by Casetify, which if you actually have been watching my vlogs for a while, you know I'm obsessed with them. Half of my phone cases are from there. Literally, the one I have on right now is freaking from there. This one's just a clear one. Even, oh my God, my freaking computer case. I'm currently importing, but this computer case, I did an unboxing a few months ago. I've gotten so many questions of where it's from. It's from Casetify as well. I just did a custom one. I was able to put in like all the photos. You can even decide the complete like layout you wanna do. That wasn't sponsored. I bought that with my own money, but they hit me up and I was so excited because I was like, yo, I mean, I'm like a fan. Like, I love your guys' stuff. So they asked me to pick out a few cases, but I'm not sure which ones they actually sent. Hi. Oh my God, I'm so excited. What I love about their cases is I think they're the first brand I ever saw have cute cases that still protect your phone. You guys know me, I'm brutal with everything. I throw my vlog camera around, I throw my phone around. Oh my God, they sent masks. Oh my God, these are so cute. Shut up, wait, that is so cute. Wow, sorry, that got me really excited. Guys, these are so cute. Okay, so not only are they like super freaking cute, I mean like, come on, this is so cute. <gasps> They sent the one thing that I was like, real, like I was going to personally buy this. Oh my God, there's so much to show you. Okay, first I'll go through the cases. They sent this one, which is literally a little like cassette tape, which I think is so cute. I love the neon pink. I was looking for like a neon pink case and that was one of the few ones they had. Then I also got this one, which I'm so excited for. It says AM all over it. You can totally customize it. You can even decide like whatever colors you want or anything. The next one is this really cute like butterfly case one. And then this one is just like an oatmeal kind of color and it says Alicia right here, which I think is really cute. Ah! 
but the best thing about them is that they're actually military drop protection so you guys can literally drop these and they will not break I've dropped my phone so many times and I swear they don't break I feel like we should do the butterfly one because this one's really cute so not only do you get a really cute case you also get great protection for your phone like guys how freaking cute is this I'm obsessed the thing too that they're known for all of these cases are like fully customizable like for instance this butterfly one you can actually get different colors on the outside you can totally change the actual color of the case or you can also customize some this way where you can like put your name on it you can customize them in so many different ways that's why I'm a huge fan of them because there are literally thousands of ways that you can customize all of these cases oh they're cleansing wipes I love watching brands kind of give back right now and I know Caseify is actually doing a lot they've donated like thousands of masks and they've just been doing a lot they came out with Caseify Protect so they have like sanitizing wipes they even have a UV thing for your phone that you can put in which I never would have thought to get a sanitizer for my phone which actually makes so much sense so I just love that they're giving back and stuff and doing more than like a lot of brands right now I feel like I should show you guys how much this actually works like you guys know me I am so brutal I like will throw my phone everywhere it's really bad it's a problem but it's not because we protected okay so here is a before of my phone yes there's a million fingerprints all the way around it I'm gonna do the unthinkable <laughs> I can't believe I'm doing this but like I have full faith And the best part is that, guys, look. Moment of truth. This side looks good. Oh my god. Like, I'm sorry. Tell me another phone case that does this. Okay. Ooh, don't die, Alicia. Okay, ready? Oh, look. It's totally fine. <laughs> Literally screen is completely fine other than having fingerprints all over it. The back is fine. Like even the sides, totally good. And yes, phone is actually working. That's insane. So I actually found out about them from a lot of celebrities. Like I saw Kylie Jenner post using one of their cases, Bella Hadid, like Dua Lipa. I just saw it take over social media and I'm like, oh. Well, let me get on them. I just like how they're not clunky. They're not ugly. They're cute that actually protect your phone case because I feel like I used to always have to decide do I want a phone case because it's cute or do I want like one that'll actually protect it. Anyways, the one that I'm so excited to show you guys right now is something that you're gonna want it. I had no idea they made these. I'm so excited. They have this chain lanyard that connects to some of their phone cases to where you can literally wear it like around your neck. Guys, how dope is this? I love it. I think it's the cutest thing ever. It's like super trendy, super stylish, but like you can have your phone around your neck. It's so freaking cute. They also have a whole bunch of other collaborations. Like they've done Lisa Frank, they've done Coca-Cola. They do collabs with really epic, awesome brands. So yeah, I think you guys will like them if you haven't already tried them out, definitely do that. And I'm really excited because if you guys actually go to https colon forward slash casedefy.com, I'm gonna have it here on the screen. Basically go to casedefy.com slash Alicia and you guys actually can get a 20% off coupon and you can twin with me. You can get this one. You can get the freaking dope chain one. Yeah, links are in the description box and a huge shout out to them for sponsoring because seriously, I've been a fan for years and I'm just like, it means so much. So yes. Okay, I was gonna show you the other package, but honestly, I feel like I could actually use some coffee right now. So I'm gonna make some. I'm just kind of like slow today. Maybe it was the hike. I'm just gonna blame the hike. I'm gonna say it's because I worked out and now I'm tired and exhausted and that's clearly it. <laughs> okay, boom, boom. Cute. You know it's gonna be a good day when we're whipping out. That was not smooth. The oat milk. Also, oh my gosh, you guys, Rosie loves just chilling there. She loves sitting at the new table. It's so freaking cute. I think she likes being covered because she's a big fan of her kennel or like dog beds. I think she just likes being like covered. I don't know if it's a dachshund thing, but she just loves it there. Like there's so many times we're like, bro, come on. So we might get her like a new bed or something that's covered because I have a feeling she'll like that. But anyways. I still would like to personally thank the subscriber who let me know that I can actually froth milk for iced coffee because I had no idea. When you hold it down, it turns blue instead of red. Would just like to personally thank you again for changing my life. You know who you are. Amazing. ASMR tingles. Okay, while TK is in Indiana, we've been trying to have a good system where she's working still. And it's been pretty good, but right now I'm gonna look over a few videos that she edited that she just sent. Guys, seriously, when was the last time I've just been like chilling at home like this? Weird, right? Sorry, I'm trying to get you guys way better lighting. Also guys, posted a new Instagram this morning. All I'm gonna say is be sure to turn on post notifications because like I said recently, I've been feeling myself. I've taken so many photos with my new hair. This morning I posted this one and someone made the coolest edit of it and I'm obsessed. 
I posted it on my story, Alicia Marie 24 underscore on Twitter. How cute is that? Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. So yeah, go follow me on Instagram. It's just at Alicia. If you aren't already, <laughs> TK just text O Fork, and I'm like, what? What does that mean? Are we okay? Is everything fine? Like, what's going on? We have the mother fork and roomy here. <laughs> I know, you look great, girl. Where are you going, hot date? No, I'm going to a 4th of July shindig. Oh my God, fun. I'm literally doing nothing for the 4th, I'll be here. Well, we will miss you. Okay, I figured I'd come upstairs and give you guys a nice little change of scenery. This next package, I just want to apologize to Adina's Jewels because they sent this to me literally two months ago. I kept meaning to show you guys. This is legit not sponsored whatsoever. They are a small business, I get a lot of my Wow, I just went to touch my necklaces and I'm not wearing any, which is really weird. I get a lot of my jewelry from here and they sent me this package and said they made it just for me. It's like all silver jewelry and I thought that was the sweetest thing ever. Oh my God, it even comes in this really cute little box. Oh my gosh, I was not expecting this. I literally was not expecting this whatsoever. This is the sweetest thing ever. The owner DM'd me on Instagram and was like, we'd love to send you something and this is so sweet and I'm so sorry. I'm just now opening it, I feel so bad, but this literally feels like so personalized. Like I would wear every single one of these pieces and I'm obsessed with all of them. Oh my God, the little like lightning bolts, wait. I seriously always get questions of where I get my jewelry from and this is one of my favorite stores. This one is so pretty. I don't know the exact name. I know something bone. I think of the technical name of this type of chain. That is stunning. This necklace is also dope. I think I'm pretty sure it's like two in one. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I love having necklaces like this when they look layered, but it's really just one necklace and they get way less tangled that way, which is so awesome. As far as earrings, I think I'm like set for life now. These are so cute. I love the little lightning bolt one. And then all of these ones too, like the tiny little hoops. Like these are so me. Thank you so much, you guys. I'm obsessed. Definitely check them out this is wow thank you so while i put some of these on oh just kidding just kidding these are two separate oh this is a bracelet uh, okay well i would love to get an instagram today because i'm like i got ready so like we need to document this because we didn't do heat on our hair for no reason you know what i mean okay oh you know i'm so in text you and you're like I haven't talked to you in a long time. Ooh, great question of the day. If that's happened to you recently, like who was it? Was it like an ex-boyfriend? Was it an old best friend? Was it just like a neighbor? Also guys, I have <laughs> very sad news. As you know, I've changed my hair, which I've talked about a million times. One of my number one favorites, this whole quarantine, this whole, I know quarantine's not the proper word to use, but social isolation, whatever. Like, the past few months I've been obsessed with hair clips, right? Well, you guys know, cause you watch the vlogs, I've been wearing them almost every single day and now my hair is too thick <laughs> so literally all my clips don't fit i think i could technically do like a half up moment and do a clip that way but it's just so different it's still cute but it's just not the same so i'm hoping this works i'm gonna try it out right now i just got this big clip from amazon as you can tell it is much larger than this one it was the only like kind of cute one that i could find of a jaw clip that still had this like older 90s feel to it i'm hoping it works i feel like it's just not gonna be the same. I'm also like, how does this work with extensions? Ooh, like, yeah, that hurt. Not as cute. <laughs> I have a feeling I just have to get like a different style clip. Also, the ends of my hair just look like weeds. Like, they're just like not cute. So far, I've had no regrets for my hair except the time that I tried to put this clip in and realized it just did not work. It'll stay for two seconds and then it'll fall out or just get loose. So, anyone that has long, thick hair, please let me know if you have any recommendations. I also put on some of the jewelry and I thought it looked really cute. So, maybe I'll start doing more half up things. That's cute. It's exciting to like find new hairstyles. This is cute. I like this, but I just need to find really good like no heat hairstyles. Obviously I can do braids. Obviously I can throw it in like a tighter bun or something. I'm just like not used to this. I don't know if it looks cute in the back, but that's just putting one of these little clips there. I'm gonna try this big one one more time. Maybe I'm just not used to my hair being so big. Also, my hair's pretty dirty. Like there's a lot of product in here. So maybe if it was cleaner, these pieces would be less stringy. But also I feel like I love putting my hair up when my hair is dirty. Like that's when I want to put it up. So I don't know, man. Still cute. I'm glad I got the bigger clip. This one's from Amazon, like I said. So I'll have it linked below and have my affiliate link if you want to 
buy it. But anyways, so I actually have about 15 minutes or so until I have therapy. I've been doing it for like a while now. I talk about it on Pretty Basic way more than on here, but I have that in 15 minutes. We always just do a Zoom call. So I think what I'm gonna do is just clean up a little bit because my room, it's not horrible, but I'm like, you know what, Alicia, that's what we gotta do. We gotta clean it before it gets horrible. So then you don't have to take a whole day to clean if you just clean as you go. I'm trying, we are trying. We just have like stuff over here. I have those shirts I need to put away. And then Rem and I recorded the podcast in here yesterday. So I have like blankets and pillows and stuff that we use to kind of absorb sound. So it's less echoey when we record, but I need to put all that away too. So it's really not bad. And I also have some dirty clothes that we really need to wash. Chloe May, let's do it. Oh my God, you guys, I just realized I actually haven't shown you these shirts up close yet. And I really want to because they're so freaking dope. The white one's hard to see, but the white one is obviously one of my favorite ones because you guys know I love white t-shirts and white crop tops and all that stuff. These are the monochromatic new shirts we have on Shop Alicia Marie. Like, I don't know if you can see this. They're 3D. This is textured. It almost feels like it's like raised. I don't know how else to explain it. It's not just printed on. And that's why the white one's like my favorite because you can definitely see it. I feel like they kind of are hard to photograph, but they are so cool. Like you can feel it, it's textured, it's raised. It just feels so much more expensive than being printed on. This one I cropped and I've had a lot of people say, they're like, oh my God, why do you always cut yours? I used to come out with a lot more cropped stuff, but I feel like this way, it's just a little more inclusive for like, if people want a t-shirt, they can have a t-shirt, but if they want a cropped shirt, they can just cut it themselves. I feel like it's just easier that way. If you want it cropped, cut it. If you don't, don't. Or you can roll it and tie it. You can see this one really well. It's like so freaking cool. You guys know, neon has been one of my favorite like colors, like this neon yellow green. This one was also, hard to photograph because I felt like it kept coming up a little more green, but this one's dope. Dang it, Chloe. You moved, monkey. She said, bitch, you woke me up. I love you. Oh my God, she actually looks like she hates me. Okay, so therapy went really well. Always love finding more out about myself that I was like, oh, <laughs> I should work on that. And then I actually ended up FaceTiming Natalie from Natalie's outlet and that was really fun too. So now I'm kind of just been chilling here. I'm not gonna lie. I spent like 45 minutes refreshing my phone watching TikToks and I was like, I need to get off my phone, continue the day. Yeah, I probably should clean more, but I don't really want to. I did clean my closet though. So that was, that was exciting. Hey guys, so I, I left my vlog camera downstairs, but I figured I would end the vlog still because we gonna end the vlog. I love you guys, and I will talk to you later. Okay, bye. This is terrifying. Hope, I, yeah.